Welcome back to another Raised by Wolves Gaming episode. Thank you so much to everybody who has subscribed to our channel. Thank you for viewing and liking our videos. We really appreciate it. And today we're going to take a look at the Badger CCL. This is a low rate of fire, high impact style of scout rifle. It was available in previous versions of Destiny and you can still get it in year 3 through scout rifle packages and maybe a couple other means, I don't know. I got mine from a scout rifle package though. It has red dot ores sight, range lens, and true sight. Who's next? A kill with a final round in the magazine increases reload speed, perfect balance, injection mold, and custom optics, as well as Army of One. Quick unassisted kills with this weapon reduce grenade and melee cooldown. This is a decent overall roll for me. It has plenty of impact in range, decent amount of stability, the true sight gives me some target acquisition, so all in all I feel pretty comfortable with this roll heading into the Crucible. And what I think we'll do today is head into a little rift with the Titan and the Badger CCL Scout Rifle. Rift. Bravo team. Okay, here we go with some Rift on Vertigo. Not exactly the kind of map that I was looking for, but we should be able to make do with it here. The spark is <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Wait, I'm I'm stuck in the wall. Oh, I got him. Yay! I'm almost dead though. Holy cow! Enemy runner active. Stop them. Enemy runner. <laughs> Dude. Enemy runner, stop. I didn't have to do anything. Did I kill him? No, somebody must have. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Oh, we lost. Is it going to be another one of those days? Throw that over there. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I almost got sniped. The enemy ignited your rift. You're falling behind. Hey, that's what you get for... Oh, no, 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 no. Enemy runner active. Stop them. Enemy runner incoming. Wait, what? Can we punch him, please? Runner, stop. And him. Thank you. Ready. There we go. Nice little long range shot. There's another one. Enemy has the spark. Enemy runner approaching. Got him. Play another guardian. Make pain your ally and Oh, uh, well. It's shaping up to be another one of those days. Anybody want to take that? If not, I'll get it. I don't care. I'll do it. Here we go. Let's, let's go get a win, guys. Can we get around the backside? Yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> what the hell? It took so long to try and dunk. Oh, my God. Enemy ignited your got the kill, but I mean, jeez, at what cost? Charging the spot. There we go. Headshot ki kill. Enemy runner active. My entire team just got Nova bomb, which is kind of awesome. There's a kill. Take that. Get out of here with that mess. Spark ready. Take it. Somebody over here. Yep. Moving in. There we go. Nice Nova bomb. Five I love it. Somebody right there. There we go. Three tap to the head. Put this over here. <laughs> there he is. Nice. Long range headshot kills. I like it. Enemy runner active. There. Oh, just peek up. Peek up a little bit. There we go. Headshot kill. Come on. A couple more kills, guys. We almost... Oh my god, we lost again! So, all in all, thoughts on this weapon? Um, it's pretty decent. I would exchange this Who's Next perk for just about anything else that's available here. It doesn't really come into play for me, because essentially every time I get a kill, I'm just automatically reloading. It's kind of hardwired into my fingers. But, I like the perfect balance. Army of One is a decent perk, and I like the sight. 
On the right map, you can actually do quite a bit of damage at long range. You can three-shot people, get those headshots. It's pretty nice. On a close-in map, something where you're not going to get a whole lot of good lines of sight, eh, probably not quite as good. Uh, I'm frustrated by the fact that I keep getting on these losing teams. So what I'm going to do is jump back into Rift, and we're going to turn this thing around. Thank you. 